King Charles was a little startled as he came out onto the balcony following the coronation ceremony and thought he might give himself a fright, according to a lip reader commissioned by Express. The royal chats were deciphered as the royal family looked down on the people gathered outside the palace, offering a fascinating insight into the family's private conversations in a very public place. After the king emerges with Queen Camilla by his side, he warned his wife to be careful. He said, I mustn't get too close. Or I might give myself a fright. Be careful. Meanwhile, Camilla addressed the children giving orders, telling the boys to move forward and to come nearer. Once the initial shock had subsided, the king marveled at the spectacle, waving at the members of the public who had gathered outside Buckingham Palace saying, It's wonderful, this is. They then began to watch fly past but Charles appears to be distracted, checking that his family was all there, looking around as he asked, Is everyone here? They're coming in on the right. He then seemed to enjoy the famous flypast in his honor, despite it being partially scuppered due to the weather, exclaiming, look at them. Much like the king, Sophie, Duchess of Edinburgh, was worried that they were missing members of the family as she turned to Princess Kate and said, there's a kid missing, where's George? In response, Kate seemed to then nod in her eldest son's direction and laugh. Camilla and Charles continued to watch the flyby, although with some difficulty as they could not look up due to the heavy crowns upon their heads. The king, appeared amazed by the crowd who waited in the rain to see them and sought to show his gratitude, saying, thank you, thank you very much, look at all these people. Little five-year-old Louis did not quite seem as enthralled by the flypast and began drumming on the balcony, singing to himself, da, da, da. His mother sought to divert his attention, asking, can you see? This appeared to work as he then turned to Charlotte and asked, what's the copters made with? The king seems to have caught wind of Lewis's sweet toddler chatter as he then repeated, copters. At one point something caught his eye as he pointed into the crowd and said, it's over there. Lewis also caught the attention of his older brother Prince George, who was seen saying something to him off camera. Whatever was said seemed to have evoked some passion from the little prince as he replied with his trademark sass, I can't see as far as that. To this Prince George simply said, I know. Kate and Prince William seemed big fans of the spectacle with the princess calling it, lovely, while the Prince of Wales noted that the flypast was, spot on. While the red arrows were flying with colors there was lots of pointing and several members of the royal fold noted how, wonderful, the whole scene was. As the family turned to leave and go inside, the king showed his gratitude to the public again, saying, thank you very much, everybody.